on Heggy Roll on Ron over here at my house. Hey, we just celebrated my grandma's 100th birthday. Hey, you don't make it to 100, not, not very often. But I didn't know what to give her. I mean, what do you give a girl who's turning 100 years old? So then I thought, well, I want to be inspirational at the same time since there's going to be 85 people there, family and friends from five states. So I ended up with my plan. I rolled up to my grandma and I said, when I was five years old, I got the news that we we're going to move to Oregon. And it was so sad, holding back the tears all day long, going to school, because I would have been leaving my grandma. So in class, I remember we did art every day. I loved doing art when I was a kiddo. And so I did this little painting uh, for my grandma. It was made out of butcher paper. Yeah, we taped up the butcher paper and then we got the paints. And five years old, I made a picture. I rolled it up, brought it to grandma that night, gave it to grandma, and I'm anticipating the reaction in her face. I'm watching her as a little kid to see if she's liking it by her eyes. And so she got all excited. Oh, it's beautiful. Awesome. You did this? <laughs> and then she looked at me puzzled. And she said, well, why is the clown crying? And I said, well, Grandma, because he's sad, he's got to leave his grandma to move to Oregon. She goes, this is a very beautiful picture, Ronnie, and I'll keep it forever. Of course, I didn't think she'd keep it forever. So then here I am at my grandma's birthday. She's 100 years old. This is 50 years later, and I saw her this painting. Of course, she knew this painting. She gave it to me six years ago. Six years ago, I was getting discouraged in my art. She came to Oregon to live, and she brought this over to me. I, I didn't know she kept it. I had no idea. She turns this thing around and said, remember giving this to me when you were five years old? I told you I'd keep it forever, and I'm going to give it to you. And you know, five years ago, I started painting again got serious, got involved with the Mouth and Foot Painters Association, and now I have painted 50 paintings since she gave this crying clown back to me. What do you think? Happy birthday, Grandma. Thank you for your inspiration.